A dare, to dare to risk to venture in Latin. It is time to dare your senses and take this journey with me. This 94 point rated 2021 Audaire is a blend of 54% Cabernet Sauvignon, 20% Merlot, 16% Malbec, and the other two Bordeaux varietals, all hailing from Alice Peak, Crystal Springs, and Coombsville. 23 months in French and Hungarian oak. This one is very well integrated. In fact, International Wine Report said this is absolutely outstanding now, and Robert Parker Wine Advocate said it was powerful and intense with great length, and uh, it's a super bargain, this vintage. I couldn't agree more. This is probably one of the best values in Napa Valley from a quality to price ratio perspective. Uh, for $75 a bottle retail, I don't, I'm not sure you can find something better than this wine right here in Napa Valley. And that's a very bold statement I'm making, of course, but I feel very strongly about that. Everyone tells me I should increase the price on this, but I don't. And I don't specifically because I really want this to be the entry level wine in my portfolio so that you know that this is what Herna Lindy is all about. So let's get right into this. Wow. Morello cherries, big plums, ripe apricot. I'm getting like a mixed berry compote, hints of boysenberry, blackberry pie. Um, it's very floral as well. I'm getting like violets and a hint of mocha on the finish. It's very well integrated, like I said, but it's it, it's structured, it's rich, and yet very refined at the same time. It's definitely a crowd pleaser. If I were to decant this today, I would... Uh, I would decant it for at least an hour, if not two, I think. But actually, I, I actually think that the best way to enjoy this wine is like while you're cooking, where you pour yourself that first glass, you're like, hmm, that's good. And then every like 10, 20 minutes, you revisit this wine and it, it just keeps evolving on you. You pick up new notes. You're like, wow. I mean, you, you'll definitely take a journey with this wine. So I wouldn't just say decant it for an hour or two, actually, because I kind of want you to take that journey every 20 minutes, every 15 to 30 minutes, just revisit the wine and see what else you pick up because you will find that this wine is complex. It will keep evolving it, and uh, to more kind of geekier notes as you, you know, the longer you can let it breathe, the more rewarded you will be. If I were to pair this off with anything, uh, you know, you can always pair it off with like lasagna, ravioli, uh, maybe some um, duck confit, wood fire pizza, or, you know, any, maybe like a, a lamb shank or something like that. This would do very well with red meat. And if you're a vegetarian, you know, portobello mushroom, something like that. Uh, I made 248 cases of this. I think it's going to sell out incredibly fast. So be sure to procure your allocation while you have it. This might be one of the best Audaire blends we've ever produced to date. And this is one you will definitely not want to miss. So you've been given fair warning right now. Cheers, enjoy, and let me know what you think of this wine. It's had a year of bottle aging already. And I think it's just showing incredibly well right now. I would not lay this down for too long because it's so awesome right now. Cheers. Mmm, delicious.